I was literally about to eat my salad and I don't have a fork. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do my lips and call it a day. But this is my fit. Let's go pat my bag and we're gonna be out of here in like 10 minutes. Let's pat my bag. I'm just gonna use this nasty gal tote bag because I don't wanna bring my designer bag grocery shopping. So I'm gonna pat my wallet. I got this Marnie wallet a while ago and I love it. I put my cards and everything and then like I'll throw in like my lip glosses and stuff. Let me put some down. Glosses. Hey mommy, it's for you. Thank you. I'm using this one. I yeah. And I've been loving this little hand cream from Philosophy. I'm washing my hand. You wanna use some? I swear this girl is my mini me. And this is random, but I haven't had nails on since August of last year because acrylics and everything has just been ruining my nails. Um, the only thing that I've been doing have been my, let me turn this TV off. It was Baby Shark. Um, but yeah, I stopped getting acrylics and tips because, and even gel because I feel like they just ruin your nails. Despite what everyone says, I feel like they do. So I've been using this nail hardener i just started using it more consistently this month i've had it for about three months and i just been forgetting to use it um and i'm trying to just go all natural with everything for a while um and like i feel like i'm not i may or may not do anything for grease either if i do anything i might just get, get like a light nude or a light pink but yeah i'm just trying to go the more natural route with everything you know i'm not gonna say i'm never gonna do it again but right now i just want to try to rebuild my nails and if i do do anything um i might just get press-ons and call it a day so maybe i might do press-ons for grease who knows but yeah. right now i'm just using this to get my nails in order both on my fingers and on my toes this past weekend i peeled off my old gel pedicure and buffed my nails cut them clean them push the cuticles back and i just put okay. these on them and yesterday i went out and i didn't even feel self-conscious because they have like a nice glisten to them and they look clean and they look eat they look neat like it does the job so i'm packing my wallet so i got my wallet that's really all i'm gonna need i have my house keys what else i'm gonna bring my airpods and then Oh, I gotta put some perfume on. I've been using this one from Estee Lauder. Ew. Beautiful. Ew, mommy. This is it smells good. Um, this beautiful magnolia perfume from Estee Lauder. I'm obsessed with it. It's my turn. You want some? Um, I'm not gonna bring it with me. But yeah, let me go bring my bag in my room, and I'll be right back. Actually, before I go, I just realized I haven't had a coffee yet. Let's make a coffee together. So I've been on a little ice macchiato kick, so I'm wondering if I should do that. But let me see if I have enough milk. Yeah, I think I can make a small one. Probably just make one in this, and then I'll just have an ice macchiato while I make my grocery list. Um, I don't want to go to the supermarket and just aimlessly walk around, especially since I'm trying to be very intentional about like what we're eating. I'm gonna make a little ice macchiato and then we'll make our we'll do our grocery list together. Tino. You are. Okay. You put one in. Thank you. Ooh. Guys, this is literally my new fix. I go through phases. Like I'll enjoy iced coffee all the time. Now it's this iced macchiato because I love a good cold Mom. coffee drink. Coffee drink. Oh my gosh. I 
thought I was going to be able to record, but that was a whole workout because I didn't even anticipate buying as much as I did. Pushing a cart with my daughter is a lot of work. I'm about to drive off. I'll see you guys at home. Hi guys, I'm back home. All right, so I got all my groceries upstairs. I'm gonna take you guys along with me to go do a content creative day. I try to go into the city and take pictures of myself, content. So I actually style one to two looks 
and kind of just do lifestyle pictures. So I'm doing that today with my sister. And I'm just trying to make some coffee before I go so I can get my body going. See how it looks creamy? Like a light brown creamy texture. That's the golden texture that you want. Do like a splash. Okay y'all, I'm ready. I'm all dressed. So I dressed up in a fit that I can still take lifestyle pictures in. This is my comfortable outfit. So I still got dressed up so that I can still take pictures in this. But I packed two other outfits and two other pair of shoes for more dressed up looks. I have everything in that garment bag and my shoes and my camera in here. I'm just bringing this tote bag. But yeah, I'm ready. Um, I'm gonna leave here at like 9. It's 8.45 a.m. right now. And then, yeah, um, we're gonna go into the city. I'm heading to Spring Street in Manhattan because that's in Soho and Soho just has a lot more aesthetic. And it, it has the vibe that we wanna take like New York City style pictures in. So that's where we're going. So yeah. Um, I'm gonna take this trash out and then we're gonna start driving. So I just packed the car, but I realized I haven't eaten anything and I know we're gonna be shooting from like 10.30 to like 11.30. Um, so I don't want to be starving. So I'm just gonna eat this whole avocado with some like pink Himalayan salt. And that should hold me down in terms of protein and like some healthy fats. doesn't need to be pretty. I just gotta eat this super quickly. Alright guys, let's go to the city. See you soon. Bye. Hey guys, I'm with my sister. We got so much good content. So much and content. And I cannot wait to edit all the photos. <laughs> wait, what did we do? We did two we, outfits. We did two outfit changes. Two outfit changes. We did a bunch of still photos on the professional camera. Mm -hmm. We got real content and TikTok mm -hmm. content. Mm -hmm. All the things. Just a lot of filler stuff. Yeah. We did it. it was, yeah. we, did, we had a productive day. So I think we're just going to do a few final, like, some, a few, few final snaps. Like, you'll see some of the you're behind gonna, the yeah, scenes. Yeah, you're going to see behind the scenes and, like, uh, you'll see the final images on my website. All right. Bye, guys. Do you want to go grab coffee? about to eat my salad and I don't have a fork and I'm very upset so I have to go I'm gonna see, I found a chick-fil-a I'm gonna see if I can get a fork over there to Lexington Avenue then the destination is on your left I'm back home. I tried recording like when I went to the I'm gonna give you some water. Hold on. So 
so yeah, I was supposed to go to the Goodwill. I have. I'm giving you water. So yeah, I didn't record going to the to the um to the thrift store. Um, cause I was tired and it was getting cold, so I ended up not going to the place I originally wanted to go to. I ended up going to a Salvation Army, and I got a pair of beige trousers that are like they're like silky trousers like oversized so I could wear them low rise and then I got a pink men's button down so I just got two things um, I wasn't really trying to do too much shopping but yeah I got that and then I got some PR stuff so I'm gonna show you guys what I got so Mason Margiela gifted me their replica perfume this is like a gift set there's about, let me see how many scents there are. It's nine different scents. This is their memory box. It says on this cute card that they gave me, it says, discover 10 mini genderless fragrances that transport you to treasured moments of the past. Indulge in your perfect scent or make your own scent memory by layering different fragrances. For example, pairing the lazy Sunday morning and the by the fireplace for your own unique replica scents. They sell these exclusively at Sephora and Kohl's. I smelled a few of them, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna test them out yet. Um, but I, I've heard great things about Replica, and I'm definitely bringing these with me to my trip that's coming up. So I'm excited to try those out. And then Estee Lauder gifted me their. I've been looking to try these out for a while. The double wear stay in place makeup their foundation so their double wear foundation um this one is a bit lighter than i would typically go for so i think i'm gonna have to blend it a little bit with another one of my foundations but i think i can also use this as like a concealer since it's lighter um but yeah i'm excited to try these out and they also gave me their double wear smooth and blur primer so thank you so much estee lauder thank you mason margella but yeah that's what I got so far. But yeah, that's what I came home to. And then I got a few things that I ordered for my trip. But I'll show you guys that in another video. Let me let me show you guys what I got from the thrift store. I like the idea of like pairing like casual and dressy pieces together. So like my intention would be to wear this with like t-shirt and sneakers. And the chunk like a big belt in the springtime, like a tank top, sneakers, and these pants. So I want I've always wanted a pair like this. And I think they these were ten dollars in the men's section. And I know they're gonna be kind of big, but I can just belt them and it'll be fine. And then I love myself, I love some button ups. I love button downs, button ups, Oxford shirts, whatever. So I saw this cute color. And I can also bring this with me on vacation, like cover up. So yeah, and this is 100% linen, so that's why I picked it up. So yeah, I, I like, I always, I wanted a color like this for the spring, especially since the spring is coming, or since it is spring. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what I got. Right, guys I just had dinner as you can see it was amazing but yeah let me know if you want the recipe I do plan on putting it up on my website when I have some time but yeah let me know if you're interested in seeing that recipe it's really 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 good but yeah I think I'm gonna end the vlog here it's been fun thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed let me know your thoughts leave them down below let me know your comments um, but yeah I'll talk to you guys soon, but before you go, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to hit the like button, share my video if you liked it, but yeah, I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.